Hi, I'm Brian with CraftedFlash.com. We're going to boot an Asus EPC netbook from a USB flash drive. The flash drive is a 16 gigabyte USB 3.0 drive from CraftedFlash.com. In this video, I will demonstrate two methods. In the first method, we will use the boot device menu to select the USB drive for a one-time boot. In the second method, we will set up the computer to always boot from the USB drive when it is connected to the computer. The first method is best when borrowing a friend's computer or using a public computer in a hotel or internet cafe. The second method is better for configuring your own computer to boot from a flash drive. To start the first method, we insert the USB flash drive in any available USB slot. Now as we power on the computer, we'll need to press the escape key several times as it comes up. This will cause the computer to display the boot device menu. From the boot device menu, we select the USB Patriot Memory Entry. Patriot Memory is the hardware manufacturer for this drive. As soon as we press enter, the computer begins loading the distro list from the USB drive. Once the distro list is displayed, we can use the arrow keys to select the software that we wish to boot. This USB drive contains several gaming distros. Now that we have the distro list booted and running, this concludes the one-time boot via the boot device menu. We can power down now and move on to method two. The second method prepares your computer to always boot from the inserted USB drive. If the USB drive is not inserted, the computer will boot from the internal hard drive as usual. To start method two, we can leave the drive attached and power on and use the F2 key to enter the BIOS setup. Now, we need to change the boot priority so that the USB drive is preferred over the internal hard drive. This will allow us to boot from the USB drive by simply inserting the drive and powering up the netbook. First, we use the right arrow key to go to the boot screen, and then down to select the hard disk drives. Press Enter. And then down again until we get to USB Patriot Memory. Now we use the plus key to make that the top priority. And F10 to save changes and enter to confirm. The computer will immediately begin the boot process and this time it will automatically boot from the USB drive without using the boot device menu. Now we can select a distro from the menu and boot it from the USB drive. We'll select the live.linuxgamers distro and watch it boot up. Please note that the keys used in this video are specific for this computer. To learn which keys are right for your computer, please visit craftedflash.com and refer to our USB flash boot guide. Now that the distro is booted, we can play any of the games listed at the bottom of the screen. If you have any questions about booting from USB flash drives, please visit our forums at craftedflash.com.